Hello, my name is Father Jacob Rouse, and I'm the Associate Pastor at Epiphany Parish in Mason City, Iowa, in the Archdiocese of Dubuque. As I said in my last video, the liturgy is the work of the people, and we call our liturgy either the Mass or the Breviary, the Liturgy of the Hours. So the liturgy, the work of the people, every single hour. I keep mine in a convenient little case and I gave it a rose, and I've got some jank here. So uh, the important thing to know is that we pray five times a day, and we call this the breviary, which comes from the word abbreviation. The Latin root is breve, brev, brevity. It's brief. It's a brief tour of the scriptures and the saintly writings. First prayer we pray, the office of readings. This is three psalms and a large reading from the Older New Testament, and a saint. The next prayer we pray is morning prayer, which is three psalms and a canticle, which is uh, from Zechariah, which is in the Gospels, and this helps us to reflect on the life of Jesus. The next prayer, whoops, daytime prayer. Daytime prayer is a little bit shorter. It's one of the littler hours. This helps us to focus based on the, in the midst of our day. The next prayer, logically, evening prayer. Evening prayer is bigger. It's three psalms and another canticle of Mary to help us reflect on the life of Mary and Jesus. Finally, we end with night prayer, which is a rotation from Sunday to Saturday. So there's only seven options for this one. So the complete collection every single day, I am joining in from myself, a first year priest, all the way up to the Pope. We're praying every single day for you the church, the body of Christ, all baptized Christians. Now you might be asking yourself, well, I'm not a priest and I'm not the Pope, so how the heck am I supposed to pray? Well, the important thing to realize is that you might, I made a promise to pray these three Psalms five times a day. But what's important is that you make your prayer revolve around your day. Nope, that's wrong. That's what I did when I first started seminary. My day would go forward with my plan and then my prayer would revolve around it. But with these five signposts stuck in the ground like a fence, my day now revolves around God, and it revolves around prayer. So maybe it's just five minutes in the morning, five minutes at night. Still, if you plant signposts in your day and make your day revolve around prayer, then you'll see things start to come together a little bit more clear. That's all I have to say. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ the love of God and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. Amen.